Early detection of lung cancer can make a big difference when it comes to survival. A new robotic tool in the mid-state is all about getting that diagnosis. Penn State Health Hamden Medical Center had a live demonstration. Jeremiah Marshall was there and he joins us now in the studio to share how it works. Jeremiah. Yeah, Alicia Valerie, doctors at Penn State Health say lung cancer kills more people every year than breast, prostate, and colon cancers combined. This robotic technology is designed to help beat lung cancer and save lives. This is the, the first and only one in the area, Penn State Health Hamden Medical Center. Uh, navigational bronchoscopy has been around, but not with the robotic component for very long. And here's how the Monarch robotic assisted bronchoscopy works. Doctors will place a camera in the windpipe and navigate spots on the lungs with this controller. It uses GPS and robotic technology to give doctors precise movements and can see further into the lungs. With this, we can actually see the lung tissue that we're hitting. And with some of the programming that they have, they're able to give us views that will tell us where our tools are going to go when we try to get the samples. I mean, we never had that before with previous technology. Pulmonologists with Penn State Health say they have been fighting for technology like this for quite some time. We had an older technology before that allowed us to use navigation to reach small nodules in the lung. But this technology improves on that because it allows for greater reach, greater vision, and greater control. Doctors say this will help minimize complications, assist in gathering tissue, and help save lives with early detection of lung cancer. We want to improve patient outcomes, improve our capabilities, what we're able to do, and ideally just kind of make things smoother, get the diagnosis early, and ideally lower health care costs for everybody. Lung cancer is a leading cancer killer, and part of the lethality related to lung cancer is the late stage diagnosis. This device will allow us to reach those lesions far earlier diagnose them far earlier, which may translate to better treatment. And doctors say they are very excited to have this equipment and track data. They expect huge improvements in helping people survive. In studio, Jeremiah Marshall, ABC 27 News.